Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to use Excel to convert gallons to liters. I mean, gallons, I think the U.S. is probably one of the last countries to use gallons and that hasn't taken on the metric system besides excluding hospitals and science in the science world but um, yeah I'm sure the United States is on its way so to use or to find this conversion the easiest way in Excel besides just using basic math is to use a function use the convert function and a reason you might want to use a convert function you might have a whole row of data I mean could be I don't know gallon gallon data from a study you could have like several different data here and you might need to convert a whole column so that's a reason why you might want to use this function so I'm going to set up a couple columns just to show you how this function works. I'm just trying to clean this up a little. Okay, so let's just say we have one, two, I'm just gonna go on down the line and make this simple. One to 12 gallons. So we have the convert function hitting equals. There it is, selecting it from the list. Number, I could either put whatever gallons I want to convert if I was just using this alone, but I want to find out all these values. So I'm going to actually use the cell reference. And this function, it allows you to convert a lot of different measurements, as you can see. So I got to scroll through. And I'm going to find, gosh, I know it's in here somewhere, GAL for gallons. Notice that when I click that, if we were to type it in manually, you would have to put these quotes in. So comma, and then the next part of the function is liters. Liters is right there, just with a L with quotes in there. And so that's all I need to do the conversion. I put my uh, closing parentheses. I can either hit enter or click enter up here. And I know this is correct because every one gallon is 3.78 liters. And so to figure out all these conversions, I would just have to take and drag this down. And to clean it up, move that decimal place a little farther over. Yeah, so that's how you can convert gallon to liter using Excel.